Hello, Dave Farmer, Lime Consultancy, and I want to talk to you today about something we've seen increasingly more often, and that is friends and family lending money to each other to support their business. This is something that is plagued with pitfalls. So here are a few tips to try and make that a little bit smoother. Firstly, consider the non-financial side. How much do you value that relationship with the person you're lending money to? Because if one thing I can guarantee, if they don't repay you, that relationship is going to change. So consider the impact on that on family gatherings and how much you value their friendship. Because it could be that's not something you want to risk. If you're comfortable with that, then my first tip to you is never lend more than you can afford to lose. If you rely on getting that money back in a certain time scale for a purpose, don't do it. You've got to expect to lose the money and be comfortable that's okay with you. If you can't afford to lose that money, don't lend it. My second point, draw up a contract. It doesn't have to be legally drawn by a solicitor, but it has to have the key details in it. Those key details are how much the loan is, when it's got to be repaid, exactly when it's got to be repaid, exactly how much needs to be repaid, exactly on what date and exactly how it's been repaid. Also in that contract, make sure the full term is put in there and also put in the implications as to what will happen if repayment is not met. It's got to be absolutely abundantly clear. If you've got your contract and you're happy to lend the money and you can afford to lose it, my other point here is consider doing it via an intermediary. Now, what I mean by that is put someone between you and the person you're lending money to. If it's a friend or family member, the chances are they'll be more likely to repay the intermediary than they'll be likely to repay you. It formalizes the approach and it just puts a little barrier between you and the person you're lending money to. It's worth considering. So, Lending money to friends and family, be very careful of the personal impact, only lend what you can afford to lose, get a contract, and consider whether you want someone to go in as an intermediary as a point of contact if it goes wrong. Hope it helps. Hope it stops things going wrong for you. Um, any questions at all about other ways to finance a business, get in touch. We'd love to speak to you. Follow us on social media, and I'll talk to you soon.